Gospel Trading. And it's your boy DJ D Roy here on Gospel Live 365. 365. All right, here's one of her songs. All right, we're going to start off with one of her songs tonight. This one is called My Jesus and Me. And since we're worshiping the Lord, we're going to start off with a worship song My Jesus and Me. I like the title already. So let's listen to the song together My Jesus and Me. This is a story, y'all. Check this out. Touch Touch the eye of the Lord, His eyes. He who touches me, touch the eye of the Lord, His eyes. He who touches me, touch the eye. My goodness, can you hear me, young lady? Yes, I can hear you. Wow, hear you. wow, wow, wow. My Jesus and me is a song. I, I love it. Yeah. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, my goodness. Um, We are live right now with the young lady, Lisa Harris. Lisa Harris. And let me apologize publicly to you, ma'am. I did call you Lisa. Um, <laughs> I did call you Lisa Hannah. Uh, for some reason, Hannah came up in my head, and uh, like I said before, she is one of um, Jamaica's Miss World um, in 1993, and she won it too. So you're, that's a good company, good name, good good name. But your name is Lisa Harris, Lisa Harris, and uh, we have her live with us tonight, all the way in Antigua, Antigua. Tell me about Antigua a little bit. Let, let me let me let me change the narrative. Tell me about Antigua. Why am I not hearing you? One second. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Why are we not hearing you now? Go ahead. I don't know. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, you can hear me now? Much better. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Perfect. Yes. So, um, Antigua is known for its, 
it's tourism. That's our main industry in Antigua. It is one of the number one world travel destination. And we have the most, I'm not going to say some of the most, <laughs> the most beautiful beaches in the world. All right. Um, 365 beaches, one for each day of the year. One for... We have some wonderful hotels. I like it. One for each day of the year. All right now. Yeah, 365. Yeah. Wow. Wow. And that, that's Antigua for you. All right. She, she's, she sold her yeah. country to us. Um, I, I, I yeah. hope some of us can make a trip to Antigua soon. Real soon. And y'all need to take me with y'all, right? When, when you make the trip, take me with okay. you. Uh, <laughs> when you make the trip. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Let's go to, let's go to ministry. How, how did you get involved in, 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 in um, gospel music ministry, man? I have been doing music or singing from before um, I know myself, basically. Um, I was always the go-to person to do a special or a song in school. So music and singing has always been a part of my life. Uh -huh. And um, when I got saved, uh, I, it kind of just fall into my lap, right. basically, because um, from the moment somebody find out that you have the talent or the gift of singing, then they just keep calling, calling on you. Right. But um, when I got saved first, I didn't understand worship or how to connect with Christ. So to get into it, I enrolled into um, theology school and I started oh. studying theology. And I just fell in love with Christ and everything and it just you know, grows on me, just wanted to express myself and my love for him uh -huh. through singing. So that is how I would say I got into music ministry. Wow. Wow. That, that's an interesting, yeah. very interesting story. Um, um, very, yeah, very, very interesting. Tell us about you. Tell us who, who, who Lisa Harris is. People see you, oh. see you and um, I'm sure they will probably know you now in, 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 in Antigua. But if you yeah. should tell us about Lisa, Lisa Harris, what would you say about Lisa Harris? Lisa Harris is a whole lot of things. <laughs> okay. Um, I just say I love music. I love music. I love the Lord. I am very passionate about Christ. I love him. Um, I am a wonderful person. I'm a, I'm, I'm a beautiful person. <laughs> I like all that sound. I I'm a wonderful person. <laughs> yes, me. Yes, I am. I am. <laughs> I'm very kind, uh, um, too kind sometimes because I would give, give, give of myself uh -huh. until sometimes, you know, it gets really, really overbearing. But I'm very kind and um, I love people. Um, I love to give. I am also a full-time marriage counselor. So uh -huh. I'm always giving, giving, giving and empathizing with people. Um, so... Lisa Harris, I love to cook. I'm a pastry chef as well. All right, all right, um, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wonderful. Uh, <clears throat> Wonderful. Um, Lisa, so we have Lisa the wife, Lisa the marriage counselor, Lisa the chef. Lisa who's wonderful. <laughs> yeah. uh, <laughs> Lisa is the go-to person. You know, we go to Lisa, okay? Uh, when all else fails, just go to Lisa. Yeah. Go, go find Lisa. Where's Lisa? That, that's that, that's what, what you know you probably experience huh go find lisa yeah. ask lisa about that i think i have i think i have talk to me written on my forehead you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. talk to lisa about that all right um uh, that means that means you handle stress and and um stress very well because you know you, you... i would think so yeah i over the years i've developed um, different mechanisms mm -hmm. how to deal with stress mm -hmm. or not to deal with it um, rather right right um, understanding that there's some things you really can't do anything about mm -hmm. and some things you can't change right and as it is said in the word of god to cast all your cares and your burden mm -hmm. on christ so that's the easiest thing to do wow yeah about music, all right. About music, you have you have uh, about five songs that I have here, and I know you're probably working yeah. on on some some other stuff. Um, and, and I I noticed the variety that I got from your music, a little bit of this and a little bit of that. Um, I hear a little bit of reggae in there, and I'm a reggae I'm a reggae guy. I love I love reggae because I'm from that I'm from that that the, the capital of reggae. I'm 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 from that country, Aww. that island. So. <laughs> So I love reggae music, but um, what what's your favorite genre of music? Oh, uh, I love worship. 
Mm -hmm. I love worship. Um, it does something to me. It takes me to a place mm -hmm. where I can just feel the joy of the Lord. Wow. So, but to nail down a particular genre mm -hmm. um, because I love music on a whole it's, it's really hard to say you know what type of music I just like music um, once it relates to expressing the love of God or right. the need for anyone to come to Christ mm -hmm. then I'm on board yeah so wow alright we're gonna go to one of your music Fallen Soldier alright one of my yeah. favorite songs on your track alright so oh. so Let's go to Falling Soldier, and then we're going to come back and talk some more to Lisa Harris, y'all. Falling Soldier, I'm coming. Welcome aboard the late night golf train. I'm coming to get you, I'm coming to get you. The Father sent me for you. Big, 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 big tune. <laughs> big, 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 big tune. Um, listen, so, so tell me about the reggae, the reggae side of you. How, how were you introduced to, to reggae music or gospel reggae music? Oh. <laughs> um, I mean, I know you're from Antigua, and Antigua is, is you know, one of them islands who. who well, I grew up, I grew up in Antigua, but actually, I was born in Jamaica. Oh, yeah, see? <laughs> okay, see, but never know all of that. Repeat all of that again for me. Let me get it right. Let me get it right. Repeat all of that yes, again for me. Yes, yes. I was born in Jamaica, Portland, Jamaica. You're born in Jamaica? Yes, and I migrated as a child. Okay, yes. all right. So my, somewhere in my, in my bones. So, so it's in your system, man. That, 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 that yes. baptizing of you. Yeah, that, that that baptizing of your man. Uh, okay, what, what's the yeah. population? What's the Jamaican population in, in Antigua? Oh, we have a lot here. Um, I would say maybe about 10,000. You mean 10,000 Jamaicans live in Antigua? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, no, no, I'm not nervous for you. Ten thousand people. <laughs> Ten thousand people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Ten thousand Jamaicans living lot. in Antigua. That's what? a lot. That's a lot. Yes. That is a yeah. whole lot. They, 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 oh, yeah. Jesus. Um, okay. I'm going to be able to sell over there. Okay. So they're going to send them back home. Cool. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we are talking to. Jamaican, I think. Oh, my goodness. You can't imagine. <laughs> We are we are talking to Lisa Harris, um, who is uh, it, so you should have corrected me, man, because I had on the flyer Antiguan, Antiguan gospel okay, artist. Because I have to represent. Here is where you know I, I live, and this is my home now. Even though sometimes you know if I get like a little upset, you hear a little Jamaican. <laughs> <now>. <laughs> but um, I think I'm Antiguan at heart now. Ah, been, been here for so long. Right, 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 right. I mean, Right. You know, it, it's like they say you're naturalized. Uh huh. So, uh -huh. yeah. All right. So I'm you're natural. I'm not selling out. So you uh, okay? Cause, cause Jamaicans will jump on you, you know. They they will start lagging off of, of the thing, cause I you know, know, know. You know, know Jamaicans stay. You understand me? <laughs> so if you're saying it for your husband, we understand. Yeah. You understand me? Is your husband uh, Antiguan or Jamaican? Yes, he's Antiguan. Oh, okay. All right. Antiguan. If you're saying it for your yeah, husband's sake, then we understand. Right we understand, yeah. You keep your marriage together, yeah, sister. Keep your <laughs> <laughs> keep your marriage together. Yeah. Oh, I yeah. tell you, we like I said, we're talking to Lisa Harris. Um, from Antigua. Um, she lives in Antigua, Jamaican born. Um, Antiguan. Um, let me say it that way, Jamaican born, Antiguan. And um, yeah, she Antiguan. she she is talking to us live from Antigua right right now right right now and uh, it's such a joy to talk to her um all right uh Lisa let me let me let me go into the artistry side of things um what what's the plan for Lisa for the next five years where do you say see uh, yourself okay uh maybe I'm too ambitious but who can blame me you can be um, I would like to to actually get signed by one of those major record labels not calling any names okay but um i would like to be signed um, um with a label and um i also see myself like you know touring doing more traveling uh -huh. and um proclaiming the name of jesus um i believe that i have the talent and mm -hmm. the material that will take me that far mm -hmm. not tooting my own arm but right right right, right. Else, you know? i mean i'm not wrong if you look a bit you know because yeah 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 sometimes and, you know breaking down barriers for right. caribbean musicians too um i know i know that many have gone ahead i i just want to go further mm -hmm. you know um i see myself like um really take it over the world in terms of um what should i say um people being saved because of my material um my inspiration through the holy spirit um i do preach sometimes mm -hmm. um so wherever it takes me I, I just see myself going about doing god's business amen amen yeah. amen and we're here to support that we're here to support that um <laughs> We will definitely be looking out for Lisa Lisa Harris um and, and the growth for Lisa Harris um in, yeah. in this thing. All right um so you're in Antigua and uh, a lot of the the the, the Trini guys are doing. I mean they dominate the market. I mean I I, I, yeah. <laughs> I see it I see it I see it. We get yeah. the music all the time. But, you know they do, every every some artists every every week you get a a, a single from. <laughs> Every week you get a single from them. This is the new thing, and it's it's weekly. So they dominate the market. W w what is it like in Antigua in terms of gospel music? Um, in terms of music in a whole, um, mm -hmm. uh, the art form, it's, mm -hmm. it's a struggling um, industry here. Mm -hmm. um, because, as you know, the internet is, is the world stage. Right. And... <laughs> persons are gravitating mm -hmm. towards the already popular song mm -hmm. so it's it's really a struggle um for the the gospel music and artists here and antigua is not a big country right uh, we are just about 108 square miles so <coughs> just bear that in mind right right so it's like a, a fish bowl then it's mm -hmm. like a, a little fish bowl everybody knows everybody right right, right. It's, it's really hard to be crowned king in your own country and everybody knows you so you know it's just like oh yeah she sings beautifully but you know to to go out and to make it profitable it's really hard uh I, right 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 so so um all right 
who 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 is who is that that Antiguan artist that everybody look to or everybody that's represent the island to the fullest, whether it's secular or gospel, it doesn't even matter. Oh, um, secular. We we have um well well known T and Winters. Okay. Uh -huh. Um and uh, what say Claudia Peters, which is and they're they're um domineering the uh, soca. Soka the soca market, secular. right, right, right. Yeah, right. Um, but we also have a couple. Um, uh, top of my head, we have um, like Nature Kid. I'm not sure if you heard of. Of course, Nature yes, Kid. yes, 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 yeah. yes. Well, them send <laughs> him send me music every week. We That's what I'm saying. So there's some guys who send me music every week, and he's one of them. Who yeah. every week you get a, a so track. We, you know, this is the this is the have, new thing. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, he is, and he's one of my favorites too. So. Yeah, uh, we have him, and we also have like Jadiel Gore, um, John Mark. I love, love, love. John okay, Mark. okay, yeah, 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 <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, so he's also Jamaican as well. So, right, you know, right. Um, yeah, but it's it's not much. It's not much of us, and um, that's that's basically it for me. And and so. I'm waiting to hear Lisa Harris. You know, I'm waiting. Oh. To hear. <laughs> I'm, wait, I'm waiting to hear Lisa Harris a part of that that number. You, you know what I mean? Um, <laughs> at least Harris, okay. Um, speak it into me as if it is, okay. Speak it into me. Um, so, 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 of them all, who who would you like to have a, 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 a col collaborate um, item with? Um, because I've worked with them so much, I don't know if that is why my aspiration is not really to get something. But if anybody, it would be John Mark. Oh. Jeremiah. Okay, I'm, yeah. I'm, 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 yeah. I'm, okay. I, that would be the answer I was expecting. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I was the answer I expected. But um, John Mark, okay, I see that. I can see that happening. Yeah. So let me ask you this question. Let me ask you this question now. Someone is saying about the burning flames. You know the burning flames from Antigua. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Them, them, them big, but them not so big. That's what you're saying. No, no I'm not saying that. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm messing um, with you. I'm messing with you. Yeah, yeah. But I, I worked with them when I was in the secular arena. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. So always looking for a female singer in the band and stuff like that. Right, right, right. Um, right. yeah. All right, we're gonna let them listen to one more of your song. Uh, what, what's your favorite song that you that out of these songs that you've done? What, what is your favorite song? My favorite is "Take Me Out of Me." Take me out of me. Let me I save that for last then. Because I want to see your reaction to, <laughs> to that one. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to save that one for last. Here's my God. It's amazing. You tune in to the Late Night Gospel Train. It's your boy DJ D-Roy here alongside Lisa Harris of the Antigua. And we learned that she's Jamaican, you know. All right. <laughs> my God is amazing. Nod your head if you agree. My God is amazing. Do you agree with me? My God is amazing Nod your head if you agree My God is awesome Do you agree with me? My God is awesome Shout, let a whole world hear Let's put our hands together And worship the Lord Put our hands together Heal the Lord and shoot the door Do you agree with me? Do you agree with me? My God is awesome. 
Lisa Harris, ah, Jamaica, Antiguan woman of God. My God is amazing, indeed. My God is amazing. Indeed. Lisa, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. All right, all right, all right, all right. I was trying something out, but let me let me not go there. All right, we're talking to Lisa. Um, Lisa Harris, um, Jamaican-born Antiguan woman of God, and um, she is just awesome, just awesome so far. We're loving you so far, okay? Yeah, our, our love clock is up there with you so far, <laughs> okay? <laughs> Let me ask you this. What's your biggest challenge so far with this whole music oh. industry? What is your biggest challenge? Everybody cry. Finances. Finance. <laughs> money. 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 Yeah. yeah money make the mill run. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to have the right connections, man. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> that's always, that's always the, the, the issue um, with, 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 with young artists and, um, so we're gonna pray a financial blessing on you because you 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 receive you, that in Jesus' name. Yes, girl, receive it, man. Receive it because you you have good material, man, and people need to hear this. People need to hear this, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and and a face like yours, we need to be seeing that face more. Oh. Um, so so there's no no doubt, no doubt about it. We're gonna be praying for a financial breakthrough for you and your family, and that um your music career will will you know take off the way it should, yeah. mm-hmm. the way it should. Um, <clears throat> this the music takes a lot of money right studio <clears throat> through the time um, promotion mm-hmm. and even airtime like to you know mm-hmm. pay for advertisement and stuff yes. like that yes and um i know everybody is uploading to youtube but i would really like i think this is also a challenge for me too like mm-hmm. to get airplay you know because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Even though we're not as, well, I'm not as popular or famous as mm-hmm. the major gospel artists. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'm not putting them down or anything. Because right. every time I hear the song, I worship along with the songs and I love them. Mm-hmm. But rather than playing one artist song like 15 times for the day, you know, just drop in Lisa. Drop in Lisa in there, right? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Yeah. Drop a Lisa in there every once in a while, man. Come on now. Yeah, yeah. Those are the challenges, you know. That's and, how I feel. Uh, we can only um get to the people if if they know us. Right, right. Bookings as well, because if you're not up there in the charts, then it's really hard for you to get bookings mm-hmm. as well. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. nothing is really wrong with your material or your stage performances right. because you can know all of these things by training and practicing and so on mm-hmm. but you won't get booking if the people are not hearing your music right you understand so yeah it ties into it finances and just getting out there those are the major challenges Who, who's your who's your, your 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 strongest influence in the in the in the industry um i'm all over the place like you say my music is all over the place mm-hmm. um i i love Miranda Curtis and I love okay. Sasha Cobb. Uh-huh. Um, I love uh, Donnie McClurkin. Yes, the name kind of slipped me Don- in a while. <laughs> Donnie, yeah. Donnie McClurkin. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. So, so those, those... Um, they they challenge me vocally. Right, right. I like that. I like yeah. that. I like yeah. that. Okay. They challenge me, and um, they also helped me a lot because 
if you're gonna sing those songs from those top dog, I mean, you have to really come with it. You know? Right, right, right. So, <clears throat> yeah. It can't just be. It can't just be plain and simple. You just have to. You, you got to go deep. You got to go yeah. deep to, to yeah. stay up there. You got to go deeper. That's right. That's right. Yeah. All right. Let Let me ask you this a little bit. If, if If you were not doing music, what would you be doing right now? Hmm. Okay, baking. You be a cook, a chef. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you really love this cooking I, I, thing. I, you take this cooking thing seriously. Actually, I did culinary. I I studied this thing. You know. I, wow. I really, Study this thing. <laughs> <laughs> so I went to I went to culinary school actually. Um, graduated top of my class. Mm -hmm. But um, I I guess the tug of the heart, you know, right. the music. Yeah, yeah. So I think I would be maybe at Sandals. I worked at Sandals for seven years. Oh as wow. A pastry chef. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So before counseling take me over. <laughs> right. <laughs> Before counseling take you over, all right? Before you before yeah. you start taking up people problem on your shoulders, right? I'm telling you, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, not for those the same thing. Right, 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 right. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, wow. We're talking to Lisa Harris um, in Antigua. Um, and one of the things we love to do, and we're going to be doing this on a Tuesday night now, uh, we will be interviewing young you, um, artists, young gospel artists, um to promote them yeah so you're 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 one of the they what you're probably the fourth person we've interviewed so far awesome, <laughs> so, awesome. I'm in the top five. yeah so you're in the top five yeah you're, <laughs> you're in the top five and the thing is yeah. i i got your music from my friend um cornelius Sancho? yes Sancho. and um when yeah, when, awesome. when she sent me your music man i fell in love with you with with, with um your song uh, um mm -hmm. Yeah, I fell in love with your song, and then I heard "Fallen Soldier," and I'm like, "Yo, okay, okay." And I said to her, "Listen, man, let me let me let me get in touch with her." And she told me, you know, she had the connections, and she she just lined it up right away. So I love it, I love it, and um, it it, it, it seeing you in person now and and talking to you, I, I I can really really I'm feeling that vibe. I'm feeling a good vibe with you, man. Yeah, a good vibe with so you. I, I have send you some more of my music uh, yes yeah, and, and you don't have to worry well. you don't have to worry i'm gonna put a, uh, a little bit of lisa in there i put a little bit <laughs> i love the way you said that i put a little bit of lisa in there i, I love to promote yeah. young artists man because i i know yeah. how it is i i used to be an artist one time in a long long life ago oh. so i knew how hard it was work when i leave here uh-huh i'll go do some research when I well yeah, this is not too much of research it's easy to find but uh <laughs> but <laughs> I, I i remember how hard it was for young artists man yeah. i remember how hard it was as a young artist to to get my music played like i said um I, my experience was was a bit different uh, my brother looked me dead in the eye and said hey yo if for me to play one of your songs you have to give me 300 dollars this 300 us dollars he's talking about Wow. Yeah, yeah. I had to give him three hundred wow. US dollar for him to play one of my songs, so I know what it is. I know what it feels Aww. like, and I felt the rejection. I felt like you know I wasn't good enough, and um, you know that kind of stuff. Because I know Papa San ain't paying him no no three hundred dollars, but you know, <laughs> <laughs> Papa San ain't paying him no three hundred dollars because I know Papa yeah, San. So yeah. you know, when, when I was told that, that would that discouraged me. And I, I decided from there on, th from there on, I said, I'm going to study this business and I'm going to help everybody that I can to tell them what to do and what not to do, how to do it, not to do that. Don't talk to that. You know, when they start talking like that, don't do it. Don't do it. So <laughs> I, <laughs> I've made up my mind to do just that. And that's why we're here tonight. All right. Um, we're wrapping up shortly. Um, but I want to know, tell us about Take Me. Is that the song, your favorite song? Yeah, Take, take me, me Out of Me. I, I saw the title and, um, you know, I love to look into things. But when I saw it, I'm like, take me out of me. You had me thinking. So you explained it to <laughs> yeah. me so I can rest assured that my thought process was, you know, in line. All right. <laughs> take me out of me. Take me out of me. Explain that yes. to me. I don't know if I can explain it. It just mm -hmm. came to me. Well, kudos to the Holy Spirit for that. Right. But basically, um, I was trying to do do it on my own, you know, the Christian walk, the mm -hmm. life and everything. Mm -hmm. And um, after a while, I was, I was becoming frustrated right. and overwhelmed by just trying to do it out of the flesh. Mm. And I realized that 
the me that is inside of me, the flesh me right. that right. is inside of me. Mm -hmm. How am I going? How am I going to get this? Get rid of this? Mm -hmm. You know, and I I actually wrote this song in my bathroom. Um, well, well, yeah, and I was in the shower and I just break down in tears and I was like, God, take me out of me, you know. Mm. So that's where that came from. And I just started singing, singing, and um I actually was on the floor, like mm. you know, like saying, Lord, I come before you. And if you hear the original song, it is nothing like this finished product. Right. <laughs> right, I right, had right. Right. Now write down and yeah, you know. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I just really wanted help and I, I cried out to God. So that one came from my core and that's why it's it's my favorite song. Mm. It's, it's just complete surrender of, of everything. Wow. Yeah. Take me out of me. Let me let them hear some of this. We're talking to Lisa Harris out of Antigua. Take me out of me is the song. Check it out, y'all. Lord, I kneel at the seat of your mercy, knowing you are the creator of all things, knowing you are the one who created. saw the reaction that i wanted to see i i saw the reaction when i when i when i already say to you that my favorite song is this you, you're looking for something and i saw the impact the song had on you man i could see i could see i could see that it's a powerful powerful song i love it i really love it i really love it well that song that song is gonna be in my worship playlist um as of now a matter of it it's already there but I'm going to make sure we push this song right here, man. 
I'm gonna make sure I push this song right here. I have a couple of um, our hosts online. So I'm, I'm Joanne, I'm putting this in, in your box, okay? Lisa Harris is the name. You gotta play this song. See, I'm telling them publicly um, that we. we <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> We're gonna be playing Lisa Harris on on here. Um, she already said, "Love her voice, love her voice." And and Joanne is not too easy to she's not too easy to please. So I mean, if if if, oh if, she, if she love your voice, then she she love your voice. So. <laughs> So that's a beautiful, beautiful song. Very well written, yeah. written song too. Powerful song, powerful song. And and I I want to tell you thanks, thanks. And and I say this to a lot of artists who, who who write good songs. Thank you for spending time to write us a good song. You're not just trying to sketch up something. I can tell you that this was an experience. Now my final question for you is this: When you're writing a song, what do you write the song from? Do you write the song from a sermon you heard? Do you write? And I ask every artist this question because I want to hear the answer that you ha you give me. Do you write it from a sermon you hear? Do you write it from something you thought about? Do you write it from your, an experience you had um, with the Lord, or how, where does that inspiration comes from to write a song? All the above. <laughs> <laughs> so I just I just gave you the answer, didn't I? I just, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Me and my big I mouth. Could, I, could, I could just experience like a, a good worship mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and the, the the funny thing is i could be in the middle of a worship service mm -hmm. and a completely different song has is been sung right and the holy spirit just drops something inside uh -huh, me. Uh -huh, uh -huh. i'm singing along come on girl you're making me want to speak in tongues right now come on now mm -hmm. i know what you're talking about anything and, and 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 then uh, okay sometimes i would rush off the service and like grab a pen or <laughs> my phone recorder and i just put it down because, i love it you know i love awesome, it awesome or i i even get songs in my dream ah like okay um it, it depends on, on where i am right um <clears throat> with with my study mm -hmm. like the scripture like now i'm i'm in luke i'm in luke chapter 15 mm -hmm. and yeah so actually a song came to me through that passage wow nice right here or uh, it could be that i hear a song i hear a song that a prominent song popular song and i'm like okay i think they sh they could have done that they could have gone that way right right like, right right, right. To another dip another right. angle and, and i could write a song like that too so like i said all the above all the above right right wow all right um on 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 youtube um someone is asking which part of antigua are you oh <laughs> cedar grove you're in cedar Cedar Grove. Cedar Grove. She's in Cedar Grove, Antigua. All right. Cedar Grove, Antigua. I think Joan is actually making a trip to Antigua real soon. I remember when I mentioned to her oh. that I'm going to be talking to someone from Antigua. She said she's making That's a trip amazing. to Antigua. Yeah, so, so you gotta you gotta go look look up for Lisa exactly. Harris, um, Joanne. Um yeah. you gotta go look for Lisa yeah. Harris and um make sure you get a couple of pictures and uh, and thing and make sure you wear I'm your gospel. Make sure you wear your GL 365 shirt, okay? So you're working. Yeah. You think you're on vacation? You're working, right? <laughs> <huh? laughs> so inbox me, inbox me. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll hook her up with a number and everything so she can, she can get a hold of you uh, when she get yes, there. There's no way she can yes, go to Antigua yes. and, and you guys don't, don't connect. But I want to thank you so very much. Finally, um, what's a word you would give to, uh, you know, to, to, to a listener who's listening right now? Someone who's listening. And um, need to be encouraged. I heard, they just heard your song, "Take Me Out of Me." What is that word that you want to impart in that in their spirit tonight? Who's listening? Yes. Um. Oh, what 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 to say now? Okay. Uh, if ever you're down or feeling frustrated or like you you want to give up or you've had enough, I mean, just look to Jesus. He has never lied, and mm. if you check his record, mm -hmm. he's never failed. He, you know, he can't lie. Mm -hmm. Look to him, trust him, trust him one more time. Even when you're giving up on him, trust him one more time. Like Gideon, ask him, fall the rain over here, 
college over there, he will never fail you, but never give up, never turn back. Nothing in this world is better or sweeter than Jesus. And if you don't find him sweet anymore, it's because you're not eating from him, really, really eating Ooh. and stopping from him. Ooh. So Ooh. never give up. Stop it. Never Stop it. Up. Stop that, girl. Mm -hmm. Jesus. Woo! That 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 touched me right there. That touched me right there. It's because you're not eating enough of him. That's why. Wow. I love that. I love that word. Thank you so so very much, Lisa. Lisa Harris out of Antigua. Jamaican born. Let me make sure I make it clear. Jamaican born Lisa Harris, who lives in Antigua. Okay. <laughs> What's that you wanted to say? Big up my band. I want to big up my band. Sure. And sound Entertainment Ministry Band. Um, big up Cadence Studio, Soul Rise Radio, Style FM in Jamaica. All my friends, my family, and my fans. Thank you so much. Stay sweet in Jesus. All right. And how can they find you? You're on all social media platform. Talk to yes, me. Yes. Yes. Um, research. I am Lisa Harris on Instagram, Twitter. And Lisa Harris Ministry on Facebook or Lisa Harris or Melisha Harris. So, yeah. Melisha, Lisa. <laughs> Lisa, same thing. Yeah. Same body, same yeah, person. Same thing. Same thing. All okay. right, my friend. God bless you. Thank you so yeah. much again for coming on. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Big up yourself. Big up the radio station. GL360. I appreciate this. Um, thanks a million. Kudos to you guys. And I pray that God will continue to use y'all to impact the world, to impact people. And I pray that God will continue to bless your hearts and your mind and keep y'all faithful and strong. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. We will be talking again real, real soon because I want to make sure I get one of them new songs. And we're talking about a new song. I'll let you call in and we talk about the new song. Oh, uh, yes, yes, yes. All right. Looking forward to it. God Thank bless you, you, my sister. Take care. Thank and it's so nice much. to talk to you Bye. again. Bye-bye. All right. Peace out. Okay. All right. That was Lisa Harris, man. Lisa Harris. Or Antigua. Station pointing souls to Christ. Gospel Live 360.